Hey guys, my name is Sawan. Today I'm going to show you guys some cool service return shots that you can use against your friends. So guys, the first shot we're going to learn today is a backhand cut shot to the side tram like. Also, make sure that your shuttle lands on the side tram lines of the court so the shuttle is further away from both the person serving and their partner. You're going to get into your ready position, and if someone serves closer to the T, which is the T down to the middle of the court here, what we're trying to do is we're going to lunge forward and then cut. So, using your wrist, small motion, just cut down. But I'm not this, that's too big, so you won't have time to do this. You just want to come here quickly and then just Using your wrist, just bam, just small little cut shot to the side. Really effective because you're hitting the shuttle away from the person serving and also the person who is behind the server. So they really have to move a lot to get the shuttle and most likely it's always a lift and you can start attacking. So the second one is actually the same shot that we did before but the forehand one. comes towards the middle of the court, the T, you're just gonna get ready, quickly go forward and cut. So again, it should look like you're gonna lunge forward, trying to get on top of the tape and a small cut to the side. Again, not this way, not hitting up, you're actually coming on top of the shuttle and cutting down. show you is a quick little push to the body of the vehicle player so the backcourt player is going to get hit right in the body and quickly lunge forward and then tap so try to drive it forward right into the body of the backcourt player you should also make sure that your racket head is open and the face of the racket is facing the direction where you're trying to push the shuttle. All right guys, so some things to focus on before you actually hit the shot is how you get ready and your stance. So first of all, let's try to get close to the uh, service line, so you stand close to it, and then try to get into a split stance and with your opposite leg forward. So I'm a left-hander, so my right leg will be forward, and if you're a right-hander, your left leg should be forward. And then you wanna make sure your the quad that you left, the, the leg that's in forward in front of you, the quad is loaded and ready to go. So for me, my right leg is in front and then my right quad is loaded, so I'm ready to go. I can change the directions if I want to go back. Forward is really easy. And then next thing you want to do is uh, focus on where you put your racket. So I've seen a lot of people put their racket right here. That's really far from the neck, so it takes a lot of time. You won't get there early enough. So what I like to do is make sure my racket's up. That, that means it's close to the neck than usual. So because it's up here, it's easy to go up and take a shot early. I'll tell you again, so what you want to focus on is split stance, front foot loaded, so you're ready to go. Stay low, rack it up in front, and look. 